Matthew chapter 6 is a continuation of Christ's Sermon on the Mount. And the first few verses deal with how we give or how we do good deeds to others. Now listen carefully. Take heed that ye do not your alms before men to be seen of them. Otherwise ye have no reward of your Father which is in heaven. Therefore, when thou doest thine alms, do not sound a trumpet before thee, as the hypocrites do in the synagogues and in the streets, that they may have glory of men. Verily I say unto you, they have their reward. But when thou doest alms, let not thy left hand know what thy right hand doeth, that thine alms may be in secret, and thy Father which seeth in secret himself shall reward thee openly. And almsgiving is simply doing good to others, helping the poor, that kind of a thing. And what Christ is saying is there are far too many people give just to be seen by man. And they desire the applause and the praise of man, and therefore they give to be seen in such a way that people uh, acknowledge and exalt them for it. Christ says, he talks about the hypocrites who sound a trumpet uh, in the streets as if to say, look at me and all of their giving. And Christ says, don't let this be the way that you give. But it's interesting, he says, when thou givest thine alms, when thou doest alms. So he expects, he expects that every child of God will indeed uh, be involved in almsgiving, will be involved in helping those in need. That's a part of being a child of God, caring for those who are in need, loving your brethren. But it's to be done in such a way that it's not seen. It's not applauded by man. In fact, do it in such a way that your right hand doesn't know what your left hand is doing. Well, that's a figure of speech to say uh, so secretively that nobody else, none of your brothers or sisters in the church know who's doing it. And if you do it in secret, your father which sees in secret himself shall reward thee openly. There's an interesting quote by Andrew Murray that says, The world asks, what does a man own? But Christ asks, how does he use it? What a thought. The world is interested in how much you can get and gain. And if you already give a little bit, you just give a little bit so that you're seen to be some great philanthropist. But Christ says, what are you doing with what you have? May God help us to be those who give and give abundantly, but also who give so that God gets the glory, not ourselves.